uh, that's the square, that's a rectangle. Mm -hmm. um, I'm not giving you any shape or size, um, just rectangle. You. It's not. So I'm just supposed to force against it? I don't know, just draw a rectangle. Okay. <laughs> Stop! I want to draw a circle. Oh yeah, that was almost there. See the line was very like jagged, so as I tried to go to the right smoothly, it was kind of resisting me, and I also didn't know if I wanted to push it too hard because I didn't want to break it. No, that's fine. Like if you want to break it, I'd be more than happy. It was hard for me to figure out, or I tried to to understand if it want if it wanted me to if it was only shape but also size. In the beginning, I I knew. Uh, my direction of drawing rectangle was not the way that this was controlling it. So it was, when I wanted to do this, it was going in the opposite direction. It's hard for a machine to know how everybody draws or where it's going to start. So without knowing how like you draw the first rectangle, then maybe it would be able to assist you on the second. Mm -hmm. But I don't think it would be able to know on the first one. You kind of expect what's going to happen. But it's still really, really weird because normally you're totally in control of your hands and I like to draw and I draw a lot and then all mm -hmm. of a sudden you're not in control of anything. You're just, all of a sudden you are the tool. Instead of you being the creator, then you're just, just a tool. Next thought comes is that it's trying to guide me to do something and will it make sense? If it doesn't, then I will draw it the way I want it because I feel that's the right way mm -hmm. of doing it probably. So yeah, that was, yeah. And the second one, when I was doing the circle, initially there was no feedback from it, and I was trying to try to force all of it to do something, it was not giving me to do anything. And then once I, I think, once it got, I think I really moved a little bit, or you did something, mm. I, I could freely draw a circle. It would, and this could be a tool for, for me to, like, to if I repeat Habit. something like mm -hmm. 20 times then all of a sudden I know how to do it then it's all about repetition and understanding movements and stuff like that. So, so you're talking about the muscle memory that sort of arises automatically without thinking in some ways because of repetition. I mean that's that's how it works, that's how you get yeah, good at learn. drawing, that's how you get good at skiing, that's how you, like motor skills in general it's all about repetition. Uses it, it should be something which nudges me to do it and helps me. When I'm doing it wrong, maybe. So if I'm doing something wrong, then something which holds me and guides me will help, definitely help. 